Hello everyone, Rika here, and welcome back to Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. So, let's see what case we're going to take today. We'll take this one. Uh, wow, mysterious digital face! Oh, this one's fun, I guess. Okay, we'll do this one. It seems that there is a criminal calling himself the mysterious digital face has tipped the police off about, um... His planned crimes? He told Shinjuku Matagi, a cop who loves Shinjuku, uh, that he was going to steal top secret police information. This, of course, is a situation for the police to deal with. They put det Detective Matayoshi of the Cybercrimes Investigation Unit in charge of this. Such dramatic incidents tend to hurt the pride of the police force. If the criminal manages to steal the data and gets away, the blame will fall on Detective Matayoshi. If that's the case, it will be hard. It will be a hard blow for us. So I need you to help Matayoshi with his investigation covertly. Do you understand what I mean by covertly? Well, yes, but I still have to ask. Huh? You have a question? Oh, why do I have to ask all these things? I know them already. I wish there was an option where it was just like, uh, nope, I'm good. Uh, perhaps he was inspired by the multi-faced criminal Rampo Edogawa and got his name from that. Back then, the mysterious man who inspired terror and madness in children, uh, Kogaru Akechi, uh, was his name... His rival was a group of young detectives. Um, you don't know about it because it was a bit before your time. Actually, even people in my generation are too young to know about it. Huh, okay. I never had heard such a phrase before either. It most likely is a nickname of some sort. Uh, at the end of the day, it may be misspelled detective, but it reads cop. Oh, it may be spelled detective, but it reads cop. Matagi means bear hunter. Hmm, okay. Uh, Matayoshi is not very good at this kind of thing, so I asked him privately if he needs some help. Detective Matayoshi said this is a matter of pride for myself and the force and refused. But I'm not going to let this go so easily, so I would like you to support him covertly. Cool. Whatever. So, please get to work as quickly as possible. Huh? You want to know what you should do? Um, this is about stolen info from the police, so try going and asking groups of thugs on the street for information. Okay. I'll try to find out what, uh, was said in that tip-off. You go to Kowloon and ask around. You got it! I think I remember where the dude is, too. So we should be able to make this quick. Um, I remember it being on level two. I think he's closer to the end of it. Uh, let's see. Uh, I don't know. I seem to remember this being the right... One, because this was the only period I didn't know, and I think I chose that and I was right last time, so we'll see! I don't know! I'm sorry I don't know my history questions, but I wasn't taught Japanese history. Okay. Goblimon! Bam! Whoop-bam! We're so good at this now. Oh, actually, I need to... I actually need to digivolve these guys real fast. Hold on, we need to go back. Um, because if I don't digivolve them now, they're just gonna keep getting useless levels. Because, um... Uh, they don't get more ABI for de-digivolving at a higher level. At least not that I've seen. So, we're just gonna digivolve and de-digivolve. Um the way I normally do, so... Just to get stuff on the decks, because I don't really... Oh! We could actually have Marimon, that's interesting. 
because it didn't say I went over. Alright, Ranamon. Cubimon. Yeah, I know. The Digivolve, Cubimon. Ranamon. Cool. Alright, and Vimon can't Digivolve just yet. So, we're good. We're good there. Alright, everybody, let's go! And we'll let Agumon catch back up and get some more levels, but we might as well maximize the ABI we're getting for these guys. Because uh, I want to make sure they digivolve properly. I am going to need to get a Gabumon at some point and start raising it on the team too so that I can have a Metal Garurumon at some point, but maybe I'll raise a Gomamon instead. Um... So I think Zudomon has an easier time getting to Metal Garurumon than where Garurumon does, funnily enough. But, um... But then again, like, maybe I want to take the extra time with it to... to make sure it gets a bunch of extra moves and stuff. I don't know. I'll think about it. We'll see. But, uh, I do know that where Garurumon does have a hard time getting to, um... Getting to, uh... Oh! Uh, Metal Garurumon. Yeah, I think it's that guy over there. So, we'll go over there. So I'm pretty sure it's this guy. Because to me, it feels like a waste of time to talk to anybody else than other than the one that we're, we're dealing with. Yeah, of course I know. Yeah, the mysterious digital face is a hot topic around here at the moment. The cops were asking me the same kind of questions earlier. Wait, are you asking around about him? Well, I'm not saying nothing to no cop. Cops and hackers are enemies, you know. This incident must be particularly embarrassing for the police. The criminal admitted to the crime before committing it. I know a hacker who hates the cops more than anyone. Maybe that guy is the mysterious digital face. Huh? You want to know where that hacker is? He hangs out in Shinjuku a lot. He's a fiery, moody, shady kind of guy. Cop or not, you're going to want to question him. Cool. Police hating hacker. Cop hating hacker is in Shinjuku. I just got the info on the tip-off warning. It brought me here to Shinjuku, too. One way or another, it looks like our criminal is in Shinjuku. Go find him ASAP. You got it. No, oh, no, not you! Huh? You're the one from Kyoko's office, right? Uh... Hey, what's with that oh crap look on your face? What are you doing here? Huh? You want to know what I'm doing here? I'm on the trail of the mysterious digital face. I've come to Eden to ask around about him. Huh? You say you think that a hacker who hates the cops is in Shinjuku? A hacker who hates cops, you say? But how do you know that? Hmm. Okay, well, thanks for the info. If Kyoko is getting you to do something, I want to know what it is. This is a matter of police pride. It's mine to take care of. Whatever you say, Mariyoshi. Hmm. Anyway, let's look for the hacker who hates cops in Shinjuku. Alright, oh. Oh no, a back attack! Oh, that did a whole lot of nothing. Okay, uh, punch it! Yeah! And punch it! Or swipe it? I don't know. Well, that was good. Easy peasy. Alright. Hopefully we can make it back quickly without too many fights, because... I don't really have a quick way to... Um, do these battles. Although, I guess I could turn off animations, to be honest. Um, at least while we're traveling and then turn them on before, like, boss battles or whatever. That way the battles look more cinematic, but I don't know. 
You guys let me know what you guys think in the comments. If you guys want the animations for the battles turned off so that the battles are a bit quicker, let me know, I'll turn them off. If you like the cinematic battles, let me know if you just want them turned off for the traveling portions. I'll do whatever you guys think, because to me, I've seen all this stuff over and over and over again. It doesn't matter to me. Oh, Armadillo looks so sad the way he was laying there. Oh, cool. We're almost out of here, and then we can go to Shijuku, and then we'll be finished up with this ca uh, this case too. Yeah. Okay, uh, exit out. And then, probably the quickest way is to go this way. Alright, Shinjuku. Looks like we've arrived in Shinjuku. Huh? You met Matayoshi while you were asking around Kowloon? I see, you told him about the information on Shinjuku? If Detective Matayoshi solves the case by himself with that information, that'll be great. Just be sure, uh, please continue your investigation in Shinjuku. Alright, well, we gotta go over here, I think, and then that's when we find a police officer? Yeah, there he is. We talked to him. Hey, how's it going? Er, sorry. Hey, how are you doing? Something I can help you with? A hacker who hates cops? I saw this guy, but he didn't look like a hacker. But he really hated cops. He was whispering something hateful about cops by the access point to the station courtyard. I don't really think he hates the police. Um, I mean, come on. We are so cool. Someday I'm definitely gonna... <coughs> Okay, that was a strange interaction, but sure. Ed, okay, I don't know if I mentioned this last time. Does anybody else think this kind of looks like tree trunks holding a heart? I don't know. It, it does to me, but I don't know. Like, tree trunks from Adventure Time, for those of you who don't know who tree trunks is. Uh, there he is. What is it? You got something you want to ask? What the? Who the hell are you? You think you're some? You think you're so important? You're asking around. You're a cop, right? No. You're just hiding behind the power the state gives you. Tyranny, cruelty. This is a violation of my human rights. Ah! Well. Looks like he's run off into the access point to Eden. Let's go after him. Sounds fine to me. I hate the police. I hate them. I hate them. Questioning bicycle registration number. I don't have time for that. I need to get home. My favorite anime is about to start. Am I really that suspicious looking? Am I really that shady? The police are the enemy! The police are the enemy! You! You're the cop's crony! You're their little lap dog! Rawr! This guy needs to chill out a little bit, like... Oh, for a second I thought he healed me. I was like, why did he heal me? He didn't heal me. Uh... Pepper breath! This'll be doubly super effective! Yeah! One hit! Good job, guys! Alright. Whoa! Whoa, what? Uh, where am I? Huh? Possessed by Digimon? I see, I can't remember. Hmm, mysterious digital face. He stole the 
secret police data? What are you talking about? First off, I'm not a hacker. I admit I hate the police, but... I was born with a strange, suspicious vibe, so everyone always mistrusts me and treats me like their enemy. Anyway, I don't know anything about the mysterious digital face. Well, dang it. That was a bust. Did you catch the criminal? Okay, just bring the criminal straight to the station and don't let Detective Matayoshi see you. Huh? He wasn't the criminal, just shady? I see. That's a pity. No, well, there's nothing that can be done. We need to do an investigation again. Please come back here. Hey, you! What are you doing here? Haha! <laughs> Surprise, eh? Hmm? You want to know who this is? This is the infamous digi mysterious digital face. I arrested him. Huh? Huh? How do I know? This guy isn't a real policeman. He's just a normal guy in a costume. Uh, just what you'd expect from Detective Matayoshi. You've truly earned the title of Shinjuku Matagi. Right. Uh, right from the start, I never thought the criminal who did this hated the police. Shinjuku Matagi was my nickname over ten years ago. The person who knew this must really like the police. No, he'd have to be a complete fanatic. When I was going around Shinjuku asking about this, I ran into him. It's... Uh, it came to me instinctively. When I looked into him, I found out he wasn't a real cop. He's a hacker who aspired to be a member of our cyber crime squad of the police, but kept failing the entrance exam. He broke under pressure and admitted it when I cross-examined him. Wow, Japanese police are truly excellent to be able to find me out so easily. <laughs> so now I will get to spend all day every day with these policemen. Well, I guess that's not so bad. <laughs> well, it feels like catching this guy is its own reward, but... Well, I suppose that wasn't enough. I suppose I should thank you for your help. I was only able to catch him because you gave me important clues. Yep, you helped me save face. I thank you for that. Please pass on my regards to Kyoko and tell her I'm sorry for worrying her. Well, there you have it. Case closed. Right, so the mysterious digital face was safely brought to justice. You've managed to preserve the honor of the police force and Detective Matayoshi. Good job. I suppose I should reconsider our low opinion of Detective Matayoshi now. <laughs> we tried to support him covertly at first, but we weren't able to find the criminal by ourselves. He was an elite detective. That gut instinct of his, that one, that's one of his greatest gifts you can ha or one of the greatest gifts you can have. Still, the Shinjuku Matagi Matagi means bear hunter, a person who can use the footprints and smell of a bear to track it down and move in for the kill. Of course, it's the perfect nickname for Detective Matayoshi. Hmm. Alright, well, that's that then. And that is almost the end of the chapter. We have one more thing to do. Uh, I think the real multi-faced criminal was a sort of fan of the police and P.I.'s. He's probably the first ever hot, cold personality type. <laughs> Alright, so let's save, and we will end the episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. And just remember, everything blue is awesome. Rika, signing out.